I know, sometimes I see things that are really weird, okay? But I saw you in a taxi cab, but you were driving. And I saw people getting in and they thought they were, you know, needing a taxi to get to a place, but they were divine appointments just to come into your life. And God says, you're going to find people coming into your life that you're going to think, what in the world and why are they here? And some of them are going to be influential. And God says, I'm going to use you like an undercover spy. It's almost like He's hiding you in weird places where they think they're getting in to go somewhere or they think they're going to do this and all of a sudden, you're going to be in that place and it'll be divine appointments, strategic appointments. And I saw strategy coming to you. And I saw you planning some things and almost like developing some things. And I don't know what this means, but I, I saw business and I saw you having an anointing with business. And I saw God blessing and increasing and I saw you giving out. And what I mean by that, I saw you, you had your hands out and it was like I had a basket and it was... God was putting stuff in it and you were taking what He was putting in it and selling it. And then they were putting money in the basket. I don't know what that means. Let me give you an example. I, I, a guy in the stock market and I prophesied over him and I said, I, I see you giving things to athletes and they're paying you really well. And He looked at me and said, I'm in the stock market. I said, well, I'm just telling you. Well, he quit the stock market and bought this business of liquid vitamins. Now he's making crazy money because he's selling it to all these athletes because it keeps them from cramping when they play football. And this is what I saw you. There, there's, a, there's a creative side to you. And it's almost like it's been stopped up from some things in the past and I saw God just opening that well for it to be an influx for the kingdom. And so, Father, I just decree over her inventions, ideas. God, I say let the business anointing increase. And God, I say use her strategically to touch and to change people's lives. Hmm. Ah. There's times you think I'll be done. But God says, we're just starting to have fun. You will look this way, then you'll look that, then you'll look back. Say, oh God, I can't do that. God says, oh yeah, I trust. And I'll open your eyes to see. And I'll prove to you that it's me. Miracles, signs and wonders. I'll use through your hand. Trust me. I know you're not a man. But you belong to me. And I've called you by name. And I've went into your past and I've removed every bit of shame. You're totally new and ready to do. But I'm setting your identity and I'm putting that in place for coming to you as a brand new grace. Father, I release it over her. I bless her with it. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen.